Hello all, hello world, YouTube, the world of YouTube, what's up? Uh, my name is Daniel Galupo and I travel the United States and I shoot uh, commercials and lifestyle videos. Um, and on today's episode, we're discussing how to get your YouTube set up. I've seen so many videos where people are like, whoa, on, you know, on bigger YouTubers, how do you get the lighting? How do you make it all look good? And they're using like thousand dollar lights for a YouTube video. That's, I thought to myself, why not let you all know a little secret. I'm sure there's other videos like this, but I'm doing my own thing. So if you want to watch my video, cool. If you want to watch somebody else's, also cool. Anyways, let's get into it. How to make your YouTube setup in under $50. Okay, first things first, light. Light is your number one thing. Nothing in the background will make your video look fancy. If you get the lighting right, no matter what you have in the background, you can make it look good. This setup took me like five minutes and it's all the stuff that I already had. And actually the light that I'm using, I used on a national commercial a couple weeks ago and it worked amazingly well, super cheap, and you guys can use it like right now. It's not even a light, it's a light bulb. It's in a white paper china ball. So it's a ball and literally on, on a stand, there's a dangling light cord and I'm using a nice nifty uh, dimmer to dim it up and down, right? So this is the way it looks now and then this is the way it's gonna look once I increase it, right? It's, it's just so easy and so inexpensive. So how much does it cost? Well, three things you need. A light stand, right? I have some notes here. A light stand will cost you $19 if you don't already have one. You could use a broomstick, honestly, if you want to. Just make sure it stands. A hanging lantern cord, that's gonna be $9 on Amazon, super cheap. Then you're gonna need some light bulbs. Those go from anywhere from five to $10, depending on how many you get. I would get more than the one, just in case it burns out or whatever. These are the light bulbs that I'm using. It's an LED 100 watt light bulb. It's daylight white, um, medium base, great value. Look at this. I'm not sponsored or anything, but these are the light bulbs that I'm looking, using, right? It'll cost you a total of $46. If you want the dimmer, it's gonna be another $7, $6. So another $6, that'll bring you up to $50. You're gonna have a light that looks like a thousand dollar light. Yes, it's gonna look a little goofy. It's gonna look a little ridiculous maybe. But if you're sitting in your room, you're shooting all by yourself, your YouTube videos, the content that you want the world to see, nobody's gonna care. Yes, if you're doing now, if you're gonna go to clients and you're gonna say, hey, let me shoot your videos and you bring this thing on, on location, you might get some looks, but hey, it's cheap. So it's gonna look cheap. Like that's the reality of it all, but it looks incredible. The results are incredible, honestly, for the amount of money that you're spending on it. $46 for a complete light setup. It gives you this really nice, um, even light, so you don't have this harshness about the light because it's a it's a ball. I, I'm Lithuanian, so I don't know how to say ball right. Sometimes I say it wrong. The light wraps around your face and it, it causes just this beauty lighting, um, especially if you're lighting women. Um, that's perfect for women because uh, you want that nice round light so it looks even and beautiful. And guys, to the point of how important lighting is, I wanna show you, I am right now using my Sony A7R 3 which is a pricey camera. It runs about $3,200, and I'm zoomed into about 20, 28 millimeters right now um, with a basically pretty standard lens. Um, but I wanted to show you what it would look like with my iPhone. The same setup. The only thing that has changed, it's a little bit to the left side, so the shot is a little different, but you can tell the quality. Hi guys, Dan Galupo here, recording with my iPhone, the same lighting setup. I hope this was helpful, thank you so much for watching, and please hit that subscribe button, please hit that like button if you liked it, and especially if it helped you. Until next time, until my next secret, dirty DIY tip in the filmmaking world. See you later. Bye -bye.